escape from this world Running on a hamster wheel But searching for something I can't feel I just wanna be a lost girl And fly Take a breath, feel my wings spread Navitate above the ground And make eye contact with clouds Now I'm right everybody and welcome back to sweet and spicy sims it's your girl lo and we are back with another episode of the life of charisma wellington all right y'all so in the beginning i tried my little hand at machinima now y'all know i am not very good at it but i do be trying and i learned a few things from watching sim samantha i'll have a link to her channel down in the description box below um on how to do machinima and how to work like the um, angles on your keyboard and all that other good stuff so i learned a few things so i'm still trying i'm still trying but if you saw the beginning um you saw that charisma was um working in waffle house so she is working in the waffle house or the fast food industry um, she can't get a job particular at the Waffle House. So I had to kind of get her in that, the uniform and all the other stuff. But she is working as a um, in the fast food industry. That is her job. But at any rate, she was there. And this lady comes in like every night while Charisma is working. And she happened to notice her one night. And she was like, or at this shift, the shift that y'all saw, she was like, wait a minute you look familiar i think i know you i seen you and charisma was like no 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 and she was like yeah 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 i seen you i seen you you that girl who sleep in that red car behind the nail salon so of course charisma has a you know give it up and i mean she ain't really have to say that that was her i mean she could have been like no that ain't me girl i must got a twin or something like that but she had confessed and said that, that was her so this girl diamond she is 20 years old um and she is like girl why is you sleeping in your car so charisma had to tell her you know a little bit she ain't tell her her whole life story but she just told her like a little bit like how she had to run away from the group home and how she doesn't really have a place to stay and how she had to drop out of school because um she was scared to go to school because she was scared that they would send her back to the group home so the girl was like oh no 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 we can't have you out here living in your car i've been there and done that and we not going i'm not going to have you out there doing that so if you want to you can come stay with me and my daughter in my um townhouse now she like it ain't the best of the best of neighborhoods or anything like that but it is a plate a roof over your head and since you don't really you know make a lot of money you making maybe what five cents five five to ten dollars an hour then um i'm gonna hook you up with one of my girls she gonna get you to a job at this spot i work at so charisma was like mm, i mean this job is okay she like yeah girl but if you want to get out on your own you want to need to come up on some money so charisma is like okay well 
what what do I got to lose? So, you know, she real naive. She ain't really been nowhere. All she been is in her family home and stuff like that or the family duplex or whatever. And she don't really know nothing. And she really trying to make it out here on her own and try not to fall into the same patterns as her mother and her father. So she going to move in with Diamond, even though she don't even really know her. She going to move in with Diamond. So that's what we here for. Um, we here to basically pack her stuff in well she really got no stuff the stuff she got in her car <laughs> is pretty much all the stuff charisma has because she's not going to take this um this drum she's not taking this drum and she definitely not taking the bucket let me see can i get to the bucket you dare go look it's dirty child she's not taking this bucket and she not taking the bucket shower so she can go ahead and throw that stuff in the trash and then we can pick her up in her car and then she gonna go over to diamonds please um so that's what we get ready to do right now she gonna tell diamond she gonna meet her over there because diamond gave her the address so diamond like all right girl well i'll see you over there i'll let my daughter know it's cool and everything like because her child her child her daughter is a child so she in elementary school so um she like i'm just gonna let my daughter know we're gonna have a guest and you know i'll get everything prepared for you so she like all right all right thank you i appreciate you so much so that's what she going to do right now she's going to give diamond a hug hopefully it won't be no problem her giving um diamond a hug because child she don't really know her like that so she might not even be able to give her a hug for real for real let's see y'all let's see no we're not gonna complain about our parents right now but we're gonna do that later uh so it don't look like she can give her a hug so she's just gonna tell her bye we gonna i'm gonna see you later or whatever she's not gonna ask her to leave because that would be kind of rude so she's gonna actually say goodbye to her so she's gonna say goodbye and she gonna see her at her um new spot so let's go ahead and get rid of this stuff she like bye girl thank you again all right so we gonna get rid of this stuff and can she put this car in her inventory Ooh, I be loving these trees, but these trees be in my way. So let's go ahead and delete this. So we're going to sell that. All right, so we're going to say she driving off to um, Diamond's house. So I will see y'all when we get to Diamond's house. All right, y'all. So I went ahead and moved Miss Charisma into her new home. This is a lot that was built by um, CC Simi. She makes the City Girls mod, so you might have heard of her. Um, but this lot is called the soot so it is basically the quote-unquote hood but with an s because it is the sum so this is let me see if i can put the walls back okay. up so diamond lives in this townhouse or duplex right here she lives in the first one the one with the red mailbox and then there is one beside it right there and that's her one of her friends that she works with lives there and then on this side let me see if i can shift over here and then on this side is two of the exact ones so it's one right here one right here um a guy lives here his name is khalil and then this one is empty and then and they are living in here because it's a lot but i'm not controlling them i put them here by the roommate mod so um and that's by little miss sam and so you can have it like roommates and then they'll do their own thing but the main thing is to lock the doors so they won't go into everybody's or each other's homes i mean if you want them to go into everybody's house then that's fine and dandy you do what you do but i ended up locking the doors and assigning the beds to them so they know that that's their bed they can sleep there that's their house yada 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 so um, they won't be coming in Diamond's house unless they are invited and vice versa. So that's how you can do that. And that's how you can put a lot of Sims 
on one lot with different builds without actually having to control them and then on this side of the lot it is a house and then another house but I do not have anyone living in those two houses at the um, current time because they are actually empty and I didn't feel like putting anything in there so they are up for sale and then this is like a recreational place but it doesn't I mean it has stuff in there but it's mainly like party stuff so uh, let me see okay, so let's have a looky looky inside so you see like the party tables and balloons so I guess if someone wants to have like a birthday party this would be like the place for them to come like the um, community center or something but that's pretty much all it has in there it's nothing upstairs so you can decorate it however you want I just didn't feel like changing anything up on it right now because I'm not planning on doing anything with this right now so that's what this looks like and then outside all right and then right here is like the corner store so if you ever lived in um, a neighborhood like New York Philly Merlin's places in Baltimore stuff like that or DC whatever child <laughs> any type of hood has a corner store so this is the corner store and again this was all decorated well not everything was decorated um she decorated the side of the townhouses that we the townhouses that we live in she decorated those and some of the bedrooms were empty and then um the houses were empty and the recreational center was decorated and then this was decorated too so she'll decorate most of it but you can always change it like you don't have to leave it the way she left it because some of these shelves were empty and i've just put random stuff on there so like i put the alcohol over here i put the diapers and stuff over there i put this video game in here she put deco video games in there but um and deco you can't really play so i put this one in here so um diamond's daughter can come in here and play and then i put some uh food items in here that they can actually eat because they come in here all the time especially diamond's daughter she come over here and get these petrus farm cookies because <laughs> they be eating them i'm like girl no um what else is over here let me see if i can get in here okay and then i put the slushy machines i think these are ravishing slushy machines this pizza thing it was another pizza thing here but i don't i think that was mostly deco pizza and what else did i put in here i put something oh i put the coffee maker in here and the buffet thing from uh, ravishing i put that in there too and then the chips i think that is by Insane. Simnia, I want to say but don't give me the lion and then I put some other chips in here too so some of the stuff you can come in here and they can actually eat and then drink um, but some of the stuff is mainly deco and then also in her world she likes to use a lot of deco sims I just deleted them out because some of them I mean it looked real nice with the deco sims but it was snowing and they were just like standing outside in the snow so I was just like that looks special so <laughs> I went ahead and deleted them out um, but you can do like I said you can do whatever you want with the mod if you uh, I mean not the mod the lot if you download it but it is on a 64 by 64 lot and I put it in Burlington Bay so you may see a couple of stray animals walking around because that is where I ended up placing this lot and then it has a playground I'm trying to move a little bit faster. there we go we have a playground over here with a grill and patio and the dial house and stuff so the kids can play and then it has the basketball court and all that other good stuff so this is where charisma will be living at now with miss diamond all right and then i will give y'all a tour of diamonds apartment okay so this is diamonds front door so if you go into the front door or I should say diamond and charismas now so if you go inside the front door you will be met by the living room so it is the living room kitchen area and that is her daughter uh Renee but we call her Nay. I'm like what is her name again <laughs> her name is Nay. um and so this is the kitchen so all of this 
was here already so I didn't change anything I just left it the way it was I think I put the TV there and the um, coffee table and the the TV stand thing and the radio but everything else was here and she ended up calling the cable the cable people so they came and put cable in all right um, so this is the downstairs here and this is her painting on the wall this is the little doorway the little entryway um, I think that fan was there and then this is the little entryway so coming to the front door so the front door is actually so that's the window landing right there and then that's the front door so you, when you come in the front door you go over directly into the living room and then you turn a corner you get this landing right here and then you hit the steps so then we're gonna go up the steps let's go up the steps y'all maybe maybe not it's walkie 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 and then we are upstairs let me back it up a little bit choo choo and then this is Renee's room so let me zoom out so this is Renee's room and she just has her bed there she likes princesses and hello kitty so she has her princess rug her princess morals on a wall morals on a wall I'm a desk city girl gang hello kitty some lamps some color pencils and the hamper so I did put the this stuff upstairs was not upstairs so the top level was pretty much empty the only thing that was here and I'm about to show y'all if I can get out the room all right so all of this was there this is the hallway so this is the hallway here I put the thermostat there that was not there this is where it gets kind of weird because it's only one bathroom it's a two bedroom one bath but to get into the bathroom she has to kind of go through her mom's room her closet so the closet stuff was here not the clothes I put all the clothes in there but the closet um, things were there and I was just like alright I'm gonna just leave it as a closet but this is the door to the ba the bathroom there is no other door so yeah <laughs> so I added this extra door just so she had to walk through her mom's room to go to the bathroom but they have to go through the closet to go to the bathroom so that was the weird part um, I guess I could have changed it up but honestly I really did not feel like it um, but like I said if you get this built you could do whatever the heck you want to do with it uh, let's go into this bathroom am I in the bathroom I don't even know nope I'm outside how I get outside the bathroom so this is the bathroom all the stuff in the bathroom like the tub all of that was there I just put the rug and I added some clutter so this is the bathroom all right, we go out of here and we go through the closet through all the clothes and then this is diamonds room so this is diamonds room here this is her artwork on the wall ignore her bed I don't I can't find the right mattress where she'll actually be laying on the bed so I have to switch her bed out but all of that's there and then she has the stripper pole in the corner the stripper pole does not work I'm not sure why it does not work but it does not work and I put all the clutter in there and look she got her little pink rabbit where it go a little pink red condom so she is not getting pregnant today boo boo okay but um this is her spot so this is her spot right here and now it is now charisma's now as you saw it was only a two bedroom so charisma will have to camp out in the living room diamond says she did not mind so that's good and she doesn't have to pay any rent right now which is also very good so we are going to go in here I hope that child went to school it don't look like she went to school where is she at comfy cubby what what the hell is that oh so your mama then left and so you was just trying to skip school oh okay now you off to school what bus picking you up you late 
girl charisma like mm, i'm coming into some drama already because it is 12 37 and she not here but whatever now of course because everything is all attached it will treat everything as a residential even though it's a store on a lot it's not quote unquote a store because it is a residential lot so we'll just have to use our imaginations for that but i like this lot because of all of the buildings and the fact that i can um treat everybody as an individual all right wait a minute where did she just come from okay that was our neighbor that was, <laughs> that was sasha but did she just come out of here wait a minute because i know that wasn't diamond that was not diamond that walked down them steps i think that was sasha and see you can't control the neighbors or anything like that you can talk to them but you can't control them which i love because we don't got to worry about beating them and nothing like that they are not in our household so we do not have to worry about them at all so i love the freaking roommate um at, i mean how about say at mod charisma you was tired baby i know because you was out there on the street you was you was only getting little naps and stuff i do want to get a different couch it's not a sofa couch because they don't really technically have sofa couches but um i'm gonna do something that's gonna make it look like a sofa couch so when it's time for her to go to bed it'll look like it's a bed coming out of the couch so um we are definitely going to do that um like i said charisma does not have a job right now i mean she does have a job right now but she is not going to school because um she was just not keeping up with the grades one and then also she was scared that social the first place they was going to look for her is the school because if that's they gonna know that if she going to class they gonna find her in class so she was scared that social services was gonna look for her in school so she ended up dropping out so child we gonna have to figure out how maybe she can get her ged or something i don't know do they got a ged mod that would be so cool i'm gonna have to look and do some research on that one if they do maybe she can apply for her ged because we all need that baby oh it's also a washer and dryer up here i don't think i showed y'all that but it's also a washer and dryer i added the washer and dryer it was not in the original um build yeah i added the washer and dryer here outside of the from so and i put it in these two i didn't put it in the other two because the other two places were already um decorated so i was just like whatever <laughs> And this one, I just added a bed and a little bit of clutter in there. And then I added the salon chair because our neighbor does hair. But um, she is, um, that's not her main profession. That's, I'm going to just say it like that. <laughs> it's not her main profession. But we going to get into whose main profession this is. And like I said, this apartment is empty. And then this one, is he home? let's see is he home uh no he not home where his dog at him nor the dog home ain't that some ish now sometimes the roommates pop in and out like they do not be here all the time and then sometimes they'll be there all the time like sasha for the most part she is here a lot but i ain't seen i saw him once i think since he moved in and this is sasha's downstairs ain't that cute and that was all already decorated all of this was already decorated and like i said her downstairs was decorated too Alrighty, so enough of that let's see charisma you you're not that hungry but you your energy is low so i'm gonna let you go ahead and get some sleep and then we're gonna get you some fun boo boo so charisma came over here with three thousand dollars i want to say yeah i want to say she came over here with three thousand dollars so we definitely have to get her a bank account and make her have her own money um because she needs to have her a separate account um khalil got a dog i don't know what his dog had though 
Khalil, what you do with your doggy? Because I see him, but I don't see his dog. Huh. Interesting. Already. All right, boo. So you got you some sleep. Okay, go ahead and turn this TV on. You want to watch the TV series premiere? Let's see. Can we do that? Uh, Premium cable. Oh, we need premium cable? Girl, bye. Because we got cable cable. Look, now she just coming back home from school. Boo. You just went to school. Let's talk about it. And where is your mother at? Because she's talking about she at Cubby. Comfy Cubby. What is that? I don't remember that building. Okay, so this is Sasha. Charisma, come say hi to Sasha. Do a say hello. Oh, girl, don't do no glum introduction. She gonna be like, oh, what's wrong with her? <laughs> Charisma, say hi. You gotta come outside, Charisma. Because it's the door lock. Charisma, you gonna come outside and talk to the girl? Charisma, stop watching TV, please. Your phone went up. She was like, girl, I ain't watched TV in so long. Because she out here freezing to death. She like, hey, girl, my name is Charisma. I just moved in with Diamond. Charisma. Okay, they go diamond all across the street. Okay, now another issue I have with this lot is for some reason they keep going to this house across the way. I know y'all see them standing over there. So they keep going over here for some reason. I don't know if that's like the main house or what, but everybody goes over there, knocks on the door. Like if Carissa, if somebody was coming over to visit them they would go over to their house and knock on the door like if it was a delivery man or something they would go over there knock on the door versus coming all the way over here so i'm not sure how the lot was set up but it is so freaking annoying and i have to keep telling them to come in the house so that is annoying so if you get this lot beware because <laughs> everyone will go over here to this house it's like they don't recognize that this is their home over here and then after a while then they'll trickle over here or i'll have to tell them to come here but they all go to this house and that looks like exactly where charisma was about to go which is so annoying and i locked the doors over there so they can't even get in so i don't know why they keep doing it um did you did you think you say hello i thought you said hi okay she like hey my name is charisma i moved in with diamond she was like oh, okay yeah diamond told me she was taking somebody in oh uh, so you her she like yeah yeah she was like oh, okay mm. we gonna have to give you like a makeover or something she like huh a makeover oh girl you about to freeze to death oh god where is your winter outfit oh lord let me change your outfit y'all should turn it blue Oh Lord, she about to die. Don't die. Don't die. Please don't die. But you want the outfit on. Please put you want the outfit on. Thank you. Okay. Alright, that's better. That's better. Okay, stop turning blue. Stop turning blue. Okay, she she back to her regular color now, y'all. Okay. All right, she like, yeah, she told me she was taking somebody in. Diamond like, oh, hey, Charisma, you made it over here. Girl, it's cold out here. I don't know why y'all outside talking. Y'all can come in if y'all want to. She like, all right, all right. But come on in. Come on in, Sasha. Oh, and another thing. I know, y'all like, damn, girl, get to the thing. So, <laughs> so. I do have a mod where they take their shoes off when they go into the house um, because I think this whole thing is residential sometimes they'll go outside without their shoes on and then sometimes they'll have their shoes on so I don't know what's going on uh -uh, if they do not come in here uh -uh, not her daddy calling hey charisma I have been thinking of getting a new job a new job she like dad so you gonna get a job like you gonna get a job and you gonna keep a job like for real 
he like yeah you you, you know I, I feel like it's it's time for me to make that move and stuff i feel like it's time for me to do something different and and and, and you know um the judge had said i needed to um start start working and stuff because yeah so what, what what you think what you think well if the judge said you're supposed to find a job daddy i think you should you know start find a job like start a new career and stuff like you want you off that stuff uh 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 charisma huh what all right baby thank you thank you for the advice all right gotta go <sighs> oh well at least he looking for a job y'all at least he looking for a job that's all we can say at least he looking for a job uh uh he calling back again now if he calling for some money we hanging up what you want that was not her boss do i have to answer this all right so charisma just got home y'all and she is sitting up here talking to um sasha diamond just walked in her shirt all jacked up i don't give me the line about what's going on with my graphics child because i have no clue but we gonna make it do what it do so she like well how's your day at work going or whatever because earlier you was working at the waffle house now you coming home from a burger place she was like you know it's all right it's gonna make ends meet because i don't really want to be like freeloading off of you and she was like well you ain't gonna freeload off of me how much you make tonight if you don't mind me asking and she like well i only brought home 22 dollars because look what a day charisma is back home and she has earned 22 dollars 22 dollars y'all two two so um she likes 22 dollars girl what and how much you was making at the um waffle house she was like look i ain't really pulled that much into the waffle house or whatever because you know i just started so i don't know i'm only like cleaning tables and taking orders from time to time like i only took like a couple um orders today when you came in and she was like mm, so by the time you make money at that place you're gonna be like 50 years old how you want to get a house and you you know you ain't really making no money like that for real for real so sasha like girl maybe you should tell her about uh where we working at because we you know we getting in that we getting that money sasha tired child so sasha like <laughs> look she just took her a nap because she she about to go to work in a little bit she like look this child didn't went over here and went to sleep i'm so sick of her like she don't want to tell me to tell you about where we work at and then she gonna have a nerd to go to sleep like what the hell so charisma like well what what y'all into like what y'all doing or whatever she was like uh -uh, we ain't doing nothing scandalous child but you know we just take our you know we do a little something strange for a little piece of change or whatever she like doing something strange like what you mean doing something strange self-assured diamond and self-assured look she confident she like um she like look we work at this strip club okay and if you want to get the money then maybe you should work there too all right so she like you do what she like girl well we all we do is dance on the pole and take our clothes off a little bit we don't do nothing else crazy i mean well i don't do nothing else crazy i can't talk for sasha child sasha and her friends they be wilding so you know like i'm, I'm gonna take you down to the red district tomorrow okay i'm gonna take you down there and show you the spot where we you know do a little something strange <laughs> make it clap for that for that money you know what i'm saying she like well i ain't never do nothing like that before she was like girl it's easy you like to dance right she like i mean i guess so she like well that's all you gotta do just dance shake a little booty and there you go she was like well i'm only 17 don't even worry about it leroy he owned the shop he owned the spot and he gonna let you in trust and believe he gonna let you in so don't even worry about it she like um okay all right if you say so so i mean it's getting kind of late so i'm gonna go she like oh what time is it she like it's one something she like oh my god girl let me go ahead and wake this fool up she was supposed to be at the club by now let me wake her up she like wake up sasha wake up she gonna wake sasha up is we is you watching tea? oh she watches 21 john street okay she like girl you finna be late she like oh sh what time is it she like oh my god leroy gonna look he gonna break my ass off 
So we gonna unlock for Sasha, let her go. She like, oh my God, Leroy gonna get all up in my ass. She like, girl, that's what he wanna be anyway. <laughs> all that booty. <laughs> she like, girl, shut up, you stupid. All right, well, I'ma leave. I'll talk at you later. All right, it was nice meeting you, Charisma. Hope to see you at the club, girl. Hope to see you at the club. So she gonna leave. And Charisma finna go up here, take her a shower. And is she hungry? She might be hungry. No, that's Diamond. Oh, she might be a little hungry. Oh, she everything. So she gonna go upstairs. She everything but funky. She gonna go upstairs and um go to the bathroom. Well, no. First, we gonna have her eat. Then we gonna have her go upstairs, take a shower, go to the bathroom, and then get some sleep. Because she is tired. Diamond is gonna go down to the Red District. Uh, you wanna cook some? She like, is it okay if I cook some? She like, girl, you live here now. Don't be asking me no questions. Not $112 for some beef ramen. The f hell no. They tripping, tripping with that. Like, what's in that beef ramen? Gold? Mm mm. She's just going to get her some tomato soup. It should be tomato soup and um, grilled cheese or something. She's just going to make one. She like, all right, girl. Well, go ahead over there. So she got a little relationship with them. She ain't got too high relationship. But I don't understand why she coming over here living with her. But at this point, Charisma, like I said, is real naive. She taking whatever she can get. Somebody willing to help her, then she going to take the help. So let her do her. And we just going to uh, hope everything works out. Diamond don't seem like she a bad person. And she got, you know, her daughter and everything. But just because she got a child don't mean she good. But we gonna have her do her thing. She gonna go to the bathroom. And she is a tad bit hungry, but she ain't that hungry. But we gonna worry about charisma because we ain't worried about her. Is this hers? No. That must be Renee's. Is it Renee's? Who who book that? Who book is this? Put in inventory. I don't know who book that is. Maybe that was Sasha book. Didn't she have a book? I think she had a book. But she done left her book. She was so worried about getting to the club on time, child. Alright, so the same way that um, Charisma's house was set up and I tried to keep the walls up as much as possible. I'm going to try to do that here. Sometimes the walls get in the way, so I put them down. But I'm going to try, y'all. I'm going to try. Because I don't want to be looking in the other apartments. Because like I said, the other Sims, they do what they want. So if they in there, bow, chicka, bow, bow, um yeah we don't need to see all that <laughs> so <laughs> i was trying to keep the walls up as much as possible all right rizma you is finished okay renee did you do your homework miss i want to go to school late i'm surprised you had to go to school because it was a whole freaking blizzard so apparently you ain't do your homework do your homework you got school today is it still a blizzard Nope. Cloudy and freezing, but no blizzard boot. So you gotta go to school today. But yesterday I was surprised she had to go to school because it was a blizzard. I remember in um single mom wishing my mommy had to go to school because it was a blizzard. Do your homework. You focus but you ain't focused. Did you do it? Oh, she already did it. So up here, are you wanna show? get one skill to level two uh your mama gotta get you a tablet or something ask your mama to buy you a tablet she must be asleep because that's her sleep hair is she asleep oh no she outside playing basketball oh, Jesus. we gonna go upstairs with charisma <laughs> so i'm not worried about nobody else <laughs> i'm not worried about nobody else charisma what is you doing that's not your big baby come in here uh she don't really need a shower for real for real so i'm gonna have her let me go ahead and set up her bed all right let's see if she'll be able to get in the bed hopefully she will be i hope nothing in her way charisma get up mm, she is so doom and gloom Go here, boo. 
Where is she? Oh, she going to school. She going to school. No, she ain't going to school. Where are you going? Renee, where are you going? Not play with the dial. Why is the dial house outside? I got to move it inside the house. I don't know why it's a dial house. At I mean, I guess it could be a dial house at the playground. <laughs> but she stay going in there playing in that freaking snow. All right, so it looks like she ain't getting a bed. I mean, okay. However she got in there. All right, so she is in the bed. And this is going to be her quote-unquote sofa bed or whatever. I wish they did have sofa beds. I know they do have the um, Murphy beds, but I do not have that pack, and I don't think I'm going to buy it. Um, but, yeah. Look, she look crazy. Her head all on the sofa. <laughs> Well, we're going to make it do what it do. This is where I'm going to end this episode, y'all. So, Charisma may or may not be getting into um, the strip game. She does still have her job as a fast food restaurant employee. So, um, we shall see if she ends up keeping that or she'll get used to the fast money and the nightlife um with diamond and friends and we'll see what happens so we will pick up where we left off with in this episode where um charisma will be exploring the nightlife with um diamond so yeah y'all i hope y'all enjoyed this episode um i know not a lot happened i mean well a lot happened because she moved in with somebody she don't know a stranger and her daughter and she done met some other people. But like I said, she's 17. She young and dumb. And she going to see what she can get herself into. Hopefully, she don't get herself into no big mess. But we going to see in the life of charisma. So anyway, y'all, if y'all ended up liking this video, please go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you're not subscribed yet, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And hit the notification bell to be notified when I drop new videos. All right, y'all. Y'all have a blessed and beautiful day and a blessed and beautiful week. And until next time, y'all, peace.